Ya Imam, welcome back. Ako ya Imam, it bismillah na ako teke. Just to remind you that uh, you are still on the oath. Porque hatlo bilang ko hanim bi ibe kaliwale koro. To speak the whole truth and nothing but the truth. Porque tonya fo andu ite fumfula me manke tonya. I am happy to learn that you are fatty, so you are also fat. Ako ningkita si wot ko e kondo mu fatty di bidu wo fanam mu falle. So, so we would have a great conversation between the two fans. Uh, before uh, the break, we were talking about the authority of the Supreme Islamic Council. The Supreme Islamic Council is a symbol moment in the And uh, you told us about a particular hadith in the Quran. And you have for in other hadith, do for member al Quran no Quran. No, no, hadith. Hadith have. You told us about a particular hadith. For Monday, a hadith do for nyeng. Yes, a hadith would not be in the Quran. That is what he is trying to suggest. Ako Monday hadith wo bukatara al Quran no kono Monday wale mukumoti. So you told us about a particular hadith in which the Prophet said that if you see something that is offensive to Islam, you try to deal with it with your own hand, that is you try to change it. Or if you cannot, you speak about it. If you can't talk about it, you hate it in your heart. Those are the three steps you, you talked about. Correct? Yes, Niye kuje memu dino tanoti isa kata ya kile ibulo la ipurka bundi ning ibulo mano woto isa fo puru ya fo ka kile idala ni mo ono woto ya kong kony mu konfengoleti me ya longo ite malla farakato dino tanolem. And my proposition to you. Mundan. Me ya mar ndila ya maro mu menti la karola. In a country like the Gambia, Banco Membeko Gambia, the first option is only available to state, to the state or the state-like bodies, like statutory institutions. Amunda lo la follow moment o sembo o be man sakunda le bulu wala man sakunda e bunda lo men nulundi puru sembe faso men nyanta tar le e bulu. Do you agree with that? Ako faso nta ora ba. Man sal sembo matalje. The government's authority belongs to it. My proposition is that the first option, which is the use of force to change a particular situation, is authority that is bestowed only to the state and state institutions. Do you agree with that? Inyenta kwa mengine la ibulo la puruka bundi, wairi wobeke la symbol eti watu symbol be mansa kunda le bulu, wala mansa kunda e bunda lume nulundi aya symbol dila puru walisi o kufasa mta mande, akofu wa isonda wala. Sifuri za kanzu kwa wale tige ni yam symbol mendi ala kwa dada mta mande. But the Mimman Dial of Botamand. Well, the Supreme Islamic Council only operated on the authority that it was given and not that which it was not given. There were some powers that belonged to the government and that were never used. No. Uh, the Supreme Islamic Council was using the power to censor preachers. Amunda Supreme Islamic Council beni sembo tamani kang puru kawandi la lube kawando menke kang puru kelo kaman kawandi kang luke tame. And to ban people. Aning kamolo dolo fanan tong. And that was unlawful. Andu ufoni uni lua manta. Lua je? Say the Supreme Islamic Council. Because Supreme Islamic Council was banning preachers. It did not like. Ye kawandila ludolu tong many alonko imalafi wala kawandola. That was not based on any law of the country. O mandara lari lua wolua kampangko kanjang. Um, 
Mon sama ada dung di noto nyama purka jibe jumala kato nyapo jumala kato nyapo yo sembo di sifin sami council lela the government did not interfere in the religious affairs to ascertain who was speaking the truth or otherwise that power was bestowed on the supreme islamic council so who gave it who gave it who gave that power to the supreme islamic council saying ako jumala yo sembo di supreme islamic council la president the president on which law <laughs> he will be the one to answer that question. Well, you are the one who implemented it. You should know what is the authority on the basis of which you were given that power. What why re itele yo sembo tamandi woto ite nyanta ludula soto nale dama yalonko gunda me yo sembo dila pour ka o kango tamandi woto ite nyanta wolon nale. No no no. No. So you just accepted what president told you and you did it. Amunta ite sonta le president wey men foye drong e yo leta andu yo leta mandi. Ah wakake men be luwali be kam. Wala ya mara kake wala koto. Wala mu ala subhanahu wa ta'ala ya ayuhal ladhina amanu ati'u Allah wa ati'u rasul wa ulil amri minkum. Fa in tanaza'tum fi shay'in farudduhu ila Allah wa rasul. In kuntum tu'minuna billahi wal yawmil akhir. Tell us in Mandinka or Wolof. Okay, ala ko atelu mulu mini lima neat. Aka dia mulu lima neat mulu. Ni mu mulu lima neat ila problemu bebulu. Bar mu mu kete mu misil mulu. Ala ko dia mulu. God is talking about those who are who call themselves Muslims, who are faithful Muslims. Ala ala batu worship God. Aliya bula kila noma salona salla. Follow the footsteps of the Prophet. Aka ala batu nyama aliya kyo nyama. Worship. The same way as he worships Allah, meaning Maratha Allah, those that are in charge of you, Allah Lord Lord, those who are your scholars, Allah man sakelu, your rulers, aliyele yamaro batu, listen to their advice, nani walita. If you have a disagreement with them, Allah murundi alakang, take it to God, walma al Quran al Karim, or the Holy Quran, anin kila sallallahu alaihi wasallam, and the Prophet, walma al Sunnah. That is his way. So until now, what are we? That is what we learned. Latala, and we believe it. Ni yamaronat. When instructions come, ning aning alala islo manyo wali. And it is not in opposition to God's way. Adabe Islam ola interest letu. And that is in the interest of Islam. Abe banko la interest letu. And it is in the interest of the country. Kakuntu fitno niat. To go ahead and stop. Trouble brewing. Supreme Islamic Council. The Supreme Islamic Council operates on those lines. But do you realize that uh, that is not the law of this country? Following, yeah, Jaleko, we man can in bankola luati. Yeah, no luani left I respect. Inyanta juvela mimba landila. Ani mola ba o kalandi mola. Mola ado luile believe ay fintiji. But abe kule ala le ala kwenye nyinge ite kwenye kanaki. When you uh, set up uh, laws, you must uh, look at the people concerned, what their culture is, what their tradition is. It becomes difficult for us to disobey, especially where God says do something in a particular way. Ala kunga sali kunga na sali. God said that we should pray, and uh, you insist that we must not pray. Ala kunga ya maro ke kolu akun kanaki. God says, let's give advice, and you say, the law says, let's not do that. So we are speaking two things. Uh, Imam, I think uh, here you're missing my question again. Uh, you have cited something in the Quran which gives you a hierarchy of, who to, of whose orders to obey. Munta ya fomfonya mbota alkurano kono ko inyanta sana jumali la kangolula hierarchy walem kusanto ko ko mbe kulbe santo ko mbota wodo and you ended up by saying that we should obey the orders of our leaders. Bari ilabanta njumfala ko inyanta sana na nyato ko lula kangolula le that is contained in the Quran. That is 
the belief of all of us as Muslims. And until we know Bible, Muslim, all of them, we will not have it. But that is not the law of this country. But we are not going to bank all the laws. Do you accept that? For his own doubt, all of them. Kaola for a bank all the laws. Bunda Jamal be Jamie Alonko. Ala tamani wanyama. Tali ya aji nyama. Bari. Ala imimfo wala minti ning aningi walita manya national. There are many facets of the country's law, and if you see it in that light, so be it. But God says we should do things in a particular way. What I am trying to drive at is we have in the law books what we call the laws of the Gambia. Akwa be lafiring abebe ataka ndami kanga wale mu na buko lu soto mel mu Gambia banko la lua buko luti lua lu mel be okono abe wale ma. And those books give the head of state certain authority. And the whole law book is the symbol of the political party bank in your own cola. And none of those powers say that the president can get up and advise the Supreme Islamic Council to ban somebody, and they ban him. And the whole law book is the same as the president who will not let go. Kafu Ali Kari Tong. So what the Supreme Islamic Council did in accepting the instructions of the President was unlawful. The Supreme Islamic Council was unlawful. Today, this, this question can only be answered by Jame if he sits here himself. And based on what? Instructions came to us. And we executed those instructions. What I am driving at is you had no authority whatsoever under the laws of this country to ban anybody. Gambia Banko la Lua Lukoto. Atelu man sembe soto kamo tong abeoje o dinkira lema. Juma le sembo soto Gambia la lua koto kadino Islamo ka attack. Who has authority under the laws of the Gambia to attack to attack Islam? Ya Imam, you are here to answer questions. Ya Imam ibijan ne puruka nyinkaro lujabi. Answer questions. And we would come to that issue also. But for now, answer my question. Uh, you see, Imam, you are on the oath. Imam, yes. You are expected to speak the whole truth and nothing but the truth. Do you accept that? When you implemented Yaya Jame's order to ban people, that was unlawful. Akaka mem for all of nyinti. Fuebe son na nyinna. Birali Yaya Jame la kangota kawo londi purka molu tong. Wonin silo manta nyola. Ndalga momo ntong la ton silo laka. Anyone that we banned, we did that lawfully. Mo, 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 mo danta. A few individuals. Ya ton silo laka. And we banned them. On the basis of which law? Aliye tong lua juma ali la kango kang. Nang kalimina, the one that we swore to. Nang kalimina la brinsi taja. I swore by this when I sat here. So in essence, you telling us that you ban those people on the basis of Sharia and not on the basis of the domestic law. Amunda bini na foka nyongo, alio mario lu tong Sharia ngo le kango kang. Bari amangke ko banko la lua le ya sabu. Atale Sharia ngo, mta ban Sharia ngo. He spoke about the Sharia. I did not talk about Sharia. Well, if you talk about the Quran, that the authority derives from the Quran, how do we interpret that? Explain that to us, please. Ako wato jansi na ndi ni ni ko ni kamo bata al Quranu le kono. Sai ngo ho ho koto mu muneti kafu ni ku kari bata al Quranu le kono. Wato fa ni ngo mu muneti. Yalo. You know, we're going over. We will recede here again. No, no. 
So, il a comme un peu de temps. Il a un peu de temps. Il a This sitting will be repeated in the hereafter. So, whatever we said here, we will be returned back to it. There are many angels here. There are two angels behind me here. Whatever I am saying here, I believe that they will ask me about it. Anyone here? Imam, let's go to the question. Okay, Imam, question and answer okay. the question. Yes. Then you need to come and get left eye on the job. My salary been cut. There was a, a leader over me. Nadino ye yamar ko ngale le yamar o tamandi. My religion instructs me to execute his uh, directives. Uh, so Imam, oh, did it I, did it matter to you? that the instructions you were given were lawful or unlawful? Did it matter to you? The question is that the Imam I told you to ask Yaya Jami about that. But no, Imam, we would not ask Yaya Jami, we would ask you. You are the Imam sitting here, and you and the Supreme Islamic Council implemented an order from Yaya Jami, knowing fully well that that order was unlawful. No, no. Imam, it is a bit serious. Nte Yaya Jami ni ninkala wala ukatu, it is a mu ali mamoti, it is a Supreme Islamic Council, aliye kangol le tamandi me yalonko, Yaya Jami le yo kangolu diyala, Allah, andu ali yalonko wu nilu amanta. No, no, we were not aware that that was unlawful. I, I didn't get that. No, we were not aware that that was unlawful. But did you care to find out where that authority came from? Fodum, ya alnata nying miro soto ne purka kisi kisi ka nying wakamo bota dameng. Abora president ya. It came from the president. I did not say wakamo bota dameng. Where did the authority come from? Asembo bota mintole. Yano, bring kuwato nkwe lako malafunga diyamu supreme sami council because president binalale. Maybe atale si kuwato jabino. But you know from the from the onset, I told you that I did not want to speak much about the issues of the Islamic supreme Islamic council because the president will appear himself. But you are a member. Bari temu kafu dimole tije. Double den din na the supreme sami council. I was uh, a little shot within the Supreme Islamic Council. More tending killing. There were 11 individuals. And those were the people who were elected. Uh, uh, do you recall giving a statement? For Do you recall giving a statement? statement Do you recall giving us a statement? For a hakilo bulata wale ba, kwa yenye ne statemento dilale, kwa lemu kumakana safari mulo mmenu iteli yata. Could you answer, please? Kwa kwa isia juu to jabi no ba, kumakanya ba. Which statement? To the to the investigators. Is kisir la lo menu ni 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 si ni dia muda. Ah, kumo dolije. Some statements are not contained in that document. Ah, yes. We kumo dolije. I gave some statements there that are not included in the statement. Unko kumo dolije la ha. I said I gave some statements there, yes. Okay, yes. Uh, could you kindly look at this document to confirm whether it is the statement you had given? Could you confirm whether the signature on the signature page is yours? Kufuwe si njimu kuna tonya yandi, dame mbe sign ring for ila signature le bije ila sign ole bije. Kabila ngasa in? 
Yes, I signed it today. Because the Konya Lako Ibitala Learning Committee do have a seal. Because they told me that I was going to sit with a particular committee. Bela statement of Beri Lele Yaji, we left them in Kelaja, Mintulaja, Atu, we left them in Bondle Abond. That my entire statement will be read to me, and that I could omit those things I wish to omit, and leave those that I wish to. To have in the document. But for now, long ago, television was better than better than be young, no longer. But to know that the television was going to be present, I got to know that while I was here. So many times, so for God be with you. So I did not have the time to go over it. So I signed. So I just signed it. Okay, but this is the statement that you signed. I mean, you know, Kuma County Men signed. Mr. Chair, we asked to put it in evidence. It should be Exhibit 119. Uh, request granted, Council. Uh, thank you, thank you very much, Mr. Chair. Uh, uh, yeah, Imam. No. You yeah, just Imam. told us a minute ago. Then you found a minute killing commando. That it was Yaya Jame who instructed you to ban people. Ah, Mamunda, Yaya Jamele, Yaya Jamele, you found Aliye, Puru, Aliye, Kawandila, Ludo, Lutong. All right. Ah, we found Mutoni Aldi. Thomas na. Supreme Sami Council, not remember correctly. Toman Nakafoko Al Karban. If I am to rectify you, no individual names were sent to the Supreme Islamic Council to say that they should be banned. Name for the council of Wolomia Kawando Juve and Kawandilalo. What was said to the council is to observe the sermons and also the preachers. Radio Lunin Television. On both the radios and the television. Momo left a permit or an permit or the Supreme Islamic Council. Anyone that wanted a permit should go to the Supreme Islamic Council to get one. Committee levy. There was a committee. Ndelebe committee ni nyato. I was heading that committee. Ikanale. You will come. Inele certificates. With your certificates. Yes, see. You will sit down. Nye interview. We will interview you. Ninga jo ikoi jare talo purka kawando ke. If we ascertain that you are qualified to become a preacher. Nga permit or dealer. We will issue you with a permit. Nga radio will be safe. We wrote to all the radio stations. So, ka itandi ko mo kana kawando ka fana e permit or sort. To notify them that they must not allow anyone to carry out preachings until they are given a certificate. Uruka kambe on sabat in the Bangkok. Just to make sure that there is unity in the country. But mo killing to man na council or kafoka al kar ban. But there was no individual name that was sent to the council for us to ban the person. Uh, uh. Clearly, Senator, regulation of standards is important in every society. Jama wo jama kono purkalo tangu lutilindi akumaya ta bakele. But would you agree that regulation of standards should be done in accordance with law? Bari wo purka wo kolo tilindi aketa nyonya ndi nyama nini tilindi wo bekele aning lua la sarto le nyanda tala nyola. Ida akorta wala. What you want me to agree to is not possible. But every organization, there is a way of running it. So we were under the government. When government instructions come, Aning al Quran oman yo wali. And it is not in opposition to the Holy Quran. Aning hadis oman yo wali. And it's not in opposition with the ways of the Prophet. So na duty lam purung aja ko wai tama. It is our duty to ensure that such orders are implemented. And you would do so regardless of whether it is lawful or unlawful, according to the laws of the land. Abu wato al al ka taman ledrong wa anim bangkola lua tata nyola bang aman anil lua manta nyola bang bari atelu bo kamo taman di la le haning alima anil lua Jibe, so yani ni kumodal kama mfuo ya president na si wajabino. This question, like I told you, is only the president that can answer it. But when the instructions are given, but until ngaje kuna minke silolem. But the way we saw things is that what we did was lawful. Well, I tell you quite clearly that what you did was unlawful. It was not based on any national law. What I'm being is an end of the What I tell you, when time and the one, I need law manta nyola. Kato amanta sembiri mbankola law wo lawala. The person who gave you the authority to do it did not have the power 
and you also as supreme islamic council you did not have the power may yo kango dialla ama sembo soto pour ko kango dialla andu nga tel menu fanal nata tamandi ali ma kango soto ali ma sembo soto pour ka tamandi ñu kungo be beta yalla pour ya jamme ya moy this uh, statement would be good uh, for ya jamme himself to hear it ba la moy nu sanji tankoma sanji mo won koma wala be beta yalla no beat but if he had had it uh, 10 years or 20 years uh, earlier it would have been better because we in baby jan man dar la to because all of us were here none of us went anywhere yeah, no you're mistaken not all of us were here if but all the same but if you tell him beti jan no bar nyaw nyanding a bekling but what you said is right we should have spoken out against it yema foto nyala ka bro to molo nyanta diamula a kola no ka balang and we failed in speaking out against it motom boytale men dalilo me ya sabu manso nguli la kadiamu akwa and we are really sorry because of our failure we had a dictatorship woto akatanye balafati katu tembo sembela mararo le be kerin no wotumo but was still you implemented it but agla ta nyaw nyande nga betata man betia atelia tamandile you also failed in your responsibility to, to ensure that you acted according to law but ali fanam boy tale ko wayri aliya tamandile ama ani luwa manta nyola ali fanam boy ta jele so the failure is on both sides oto boyo nyimbe karaflo belela our side for keeping silent about it nde lakaro munan nanga nde mam fem fo je and your side for blindly following aning atel lakaro pour ali sonta pour ko kango tamandi nyamen adita la nyame I have admitted our own failure for keeping silent. Ntelu nganna lodula fole mboita dame mpuru ngande mamfem fo akodo. Do you admit your failure for blindly implementing? Oto sayen atel fanal la boida ko aliyo kango tamandile ali mang ani lua manta fo be son na walale ba. Gambian society in general nso ndako mbele be deri. Gambian society in general I agree that all of us were silent we are not talking about the silence we are talking about your actions mantara dewla kuma fokan say atella baro mbe wala fokan supreme islamic council the supreme islamic council inyanta tala nyam ita ra wala nyam the way they were supposed to operate that was how they operated ya imam naam ya imam you will never accept that your conduct was unlawful itene neto sonna nyina ko ali menka ani luwa manta nyola ani no simply because you were part of the system and you felt that following the system was what you were supposed to do that we ta fama be wo kolu kono le ne menu be ta makan wo dalilo le ya sabu ya je ko woto wayri a tel be kolu kono al nyanta wole ta mandila no want to hand in the mandar supreme sami council bare ka al kam fo to possible no la mo le mol bula min diate ka fo ni islam o kono min diate ka ta mandije wo to possible no ye fan tola fen kote la ba min te islam o te at a possible la no what do you want uh, uh, even if i was not a member of the supreme islamic council but what do you want uh, me to admit to is impossible people cannot just be allowed to say anything or do anything in the name of islam when what they are doing is not islam they must name themselves something else we other are than not, islam we are not talking about that what, what we are talking about is the power to ban people the yaya jame gave it to you and yaya jame did not have the power be men fokan jang wolen kamolu tong yaya jame le ya faliya andu yaya jame fama ma assembo so to pour kamolu tong omo sifalo min kana pour ni dia ka islam o tinya ni mo sifalo ni supreme sami council yo mo bana ay wala bayn ka wala jalle be gambe ja do sani ko ni ko wonte wonte siloti wonte silati min nyanta kala amira crossiro nyanta kala le mo bula min diate ya fo min diate politiko e manso mo bula la min diate ya fo islam o lemu feonte mi yalan ko min diata mo le ya fo do so tanish the name of islam willfully must not be allowed to do such a thing even in politics people are not allowed to do what they want it is islam that such leeway is suggested that people should be just allowed to say or do anything they want to do in the name of islam yeah imam i agree with you yeah imam son tale memfo i am a muslim i would not encourage or accept anybody attacking islam nda mo muslim old ndun tata sonna wala nyin tedd yalla nya pour mo mon dia wuli drong ka islam o kajafi but that is not what we are talking about bari mandara wo fokan jang 
what we are talking about. You said Yaya Jami gave you the power to ban people. I am telling you Yaya Jami did not have that power. You, Supreme Islamic Council, you did not have that power. I tell you, member Supreme Islamic Council, Alima Sembo Soto. Do you accept that? I call Walem for his son to water Leleba. But like I say, Ganamu Guru Muruna cycle, we will continue going over this thing, going in cycles, going backwards and forth. Yeah, Imam, it does not matter how many times we go over it. The important thing is for the Commission to have enough evidence to be able to make its decisions. So yeah. how many times we go over it is not the issue here. If the chairman does not overrule me, I can ask the question as many times I need to ask it. Yeah, Imam, among hundred million million tajang sinya jelu, mbe dame njini kang wole mpuruka tonya londi, mbe men kisi kisi kang. Hab jawo mfum se million million nole sinya jelu, ni chairman man kuntunya to purunga tambi. Nsi njini karo ke nole nyonya ndi nyama nangamu o nangamu. So answer the question. What are you in Karo Nyin Jabi? No Jabi. You did not have the authority to ban people. Alumanying Sembo Soto Purka Mulutong. That is the way you see it. There is no law in the law books of the Gambia which gave you the authority to ban people. Luate Gambia la Lua Bukolukono. May a Sembo Dialila. Puralia Molutong. But Luata Gambia, the Lua Buko, Konominko, Moyanaka, Islam, Konomindia, Yafoje. But there is also no law within the laws of the Gambia or the book, law books of the Gambia that says that anyone can just say anything about Islam. Uh, well, that is something, a completely different question. Okay, so I take it that you have no answer to my question. No, I have answered. Okay, so I take it that you have no answer to my question. No, I have answered. We have done nothing wrong. Uh, you followed the instructions of Yaya Jame blindly. Amunta Yaya Jame Yamaru Mendiyala Alison Sonta Wala Durong Abu Jiber Mankeje. Amunta blindly. The light is the Quran. It's not blindly. The Quran is the light. All right. Uh, but you would understand that our system of government in the Gambia is not on the basis of the Quran. Do you accept that? Ibe son na yena ko kafa hamuko. Nte lamara robita kanyami. Amantara laring al Qurano la charang silo lukang. Fuebe son na wala lebang. Kujamala nyanta fali na wolo. Almanya na mul karendi la Qurano la. Many things ought to be changed. You should not be teaching people about the Quran. Uh, this is not no. an Islamic state. No, 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 not teaching. No. Oh, sorry. Uh, I, I probably misinterpreted that. Could you say that again? This is not an Islamic state. Gambia manke l'Islam bankoti meya longko abetamakang l'Islam la sartol lela. It's not based on Sharia law. A manke kombe loring Sharia la lua leka. So. It cannot be governed on the basis of the Quran. You understand that? Wala na mota fono lako al Qurano la sarto nte tamano la wala karu wa manke na luwaluti. And that is in spite of our belief as Muslims and our faith and our respect for the Quran. Nyao nyanding wani nyimfata na kafu nte lumu misilimu leti lata misilime ya lela lata al Qurano la nson tama tonya. The majority of the Gambians, Gambia means yata bit. This book, the majority of Gambians, this Quran is their life. They get married through it. They do their household things through it. They are eating, drinking, everything. Their prayers, their fasting, everything. That does not operate based on the law. So, uh, Im Imam, you are mistaken. Imam, if you literally. Uh, the laws of the Gambia allow Gambia la lua lu sonta nyinale that for a muslim from muslimo everything that is got to do with marriage inheritance uh, you do it according to your religion fem fem ning akata ketaleti 
futu oleti aning hadamaya balwo kunya lika beta mandi kwela dino ya fo enyami uh, and that also applies to christians alun christiano lu fanan la balunya be onyale your personal law would govern those aspects of your life man sa mete mari kuma la fansul wa wala kawlu tamandi wonya ete son tamenna it is the domestic law that has established that amunta na banku kan taranya luwalu wala yolo londi so our adherence to sharia on some of uh, some aspects of our lives is also based on the domestic law amunta na balunya dulu melu fanalu be larin ko sharia ya fo nyami wol fanal mun na banko kan taraku taranya balunya loi leti and that is a very good thing and wo muku kende balet but it is only limited to to things that surround our existence as individuals the exercise of certain things marriage inheritance and so forth baru wo danta kulleto men yalon ko be dendin na balu nyale bala men be kon na futuolu futu sitolu alen ku ko tawlu men yalon ko ke tamandi na dino sonta men nula we cannot extend the sharia on governance our system of governance how government is run nte sharia ngo tano la ka tamandi silolu la men yalon ko man sakunda nyanta tamala nyamen nula sharia ngo nta te tambindi la ka atamandi ni wo silolu la at least for now for saying nyin tembe on follow if that changes later then it changes ni wo nata fali nyato to sine wo to fali mo sike en se tabo silolu fanan la but as at that time you were a member of the supreme islamic council baro wato wato me yalon ko etemu supreme islamic council kafu dingoleti uh, the laws of the gambia gambia banko la luwalu was not based on sharia amanta ra ko sharia ngol lemu you accept foi son tawala is man made law it is man made law so you do not respect it wato walam nyinti ko wala na ima buunya no no fengo fenni nga magni ay nyim buunya ngawo buunya la bari fengo fe nyin doya hannim falam mo buunya whatever glorifies this book i will accept it but whatever belittles it even if it is my father i will reject him nda se fano janne san sai i can die here instantly so what will i say to god Uh, you would not die now maybe it is a fallacy god has not whispered in my ears but i know you would not ko alaman fem faida bara lon ne te fallacy but what i am trying to tell you is the same thing bari in left am fem fole ate o ku klingolo the general law munta jama be la o loi respects that every individual has a religion a nyim bu nyalo ne ko mo wo mo ya fansun dino sotole and for us muslims the general law accepts that there are certain things we do do according to sharia alun tel muslim molu ya jamaa lu ay nyina hitande ko ku jamaa bi je nsa kenno le ko sharia ya fa nyami but that does not extend to government and administration bari wo mantenten ka dun nyin kono man sa kunda la do ko lu samba nya ila ko lu kenya mantra la rin sharia ka do you accept that ko kawala nyinin ka foy sonta wala en ko wala foy lu am lu walet this is what i am telling you the law is the law ya jele so at a possible no la pour ka fo ko fem fem bi jang ya sotole baro mu kulet mi ya lon ko me bi ni nga fa ya di hale ko sa ala ko afa tu minuna bi ba'd al kitab wa takfuruna bi ba'd fa ma jaza umay ya falu dhalika illa khizyun fi dunya afa al besson kitabo karado e min fo ale song karado e min fale bala wala to say that you will accept what uh, the holy book says on one 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 area and reject it the other mo mo yo ke yan kan katole be duniya jam do yale be jarabole be whoever does that you will have to suffer in, from this world so nim kon mo muslim and you will not be uh, 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 empowered by allah nintel mo muslim molti if we call ourselves muslims nyanta fero ke la loi min kan taman di ngasi nga djube mi yalon ko dina fulol min bi jang islam christianity akane doya if we are muslims we must re examine our laws and see uh, what oh, what they are made of so that the two major religions here islam and christianity But that such laws do not make them look uh, small nina da yen kalendal qur'anola be pare kana fa nyoko jallu wa 
Je ne sais pas si je ne sais pas si je ne I, so come full of me, I don't quit it. So if I come here and you make me swear by the Holy Quran and then you tell me that we are going to base everything on uh, the law, the same as a Christian who swears by the Bible, then like I said, we are speaking two different things. Uh, uh, Imam, you, you are trying to confuse things. We would not allow to be confused by all these things. Uh, the Imam, fact of the matter is the fact of the matter is you accepted Yahya Jame's order without verifying with, or without caring whether he had the power to give that order. This is what I am trying to drive at, and you have to accept it because that is the truth. Imam, I have to say that the first time I was going to say that 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 I was going to say we based, we based it. We based it. We based it. Al Quran ola kanga tamand. We based it. Ni ronta waronta. Afanya ko ronta almanya na based al Quran ola. We based it on the. Ata binga tabulado. We based it on the Quran and we executed it based on the Quran. Uh, thank you if, very much. Then that is quite clear. Inumbara uh, senar. In your statement. Ila kumaka ngokon men safeta. You are talking about the role of the Supreme Islamic Council. Be Islamic Council. Supreme Islamic Council alo dula be je four kanu. And this is what you said in this paragraph. Again, our role in the council is to settle differences between imams and religious scholars in the country. Because we came to know that many were quarreling and insulting one another. And it's the council responsibility to stop such. That is what you said, correct? Yes. Uh, and then it goes, went on to say, to bring unity among them in fasting. Idul Fitr and Idul Adha prayer time. Walem sunkari salo animbana salo la watu opuru kambengo ilo. Correct? Fonte? No. Yes. And then you went on to say as follows. I continue to say that for me na amen for letting. To say that former president Yaya Jame do involve on council work was not true. Ka foko Yaya Jame ka dabu la council la duo kuoto le nungo tumo uo manke tonyati. Did you tell them that? No. Yes. But obviously that is not correct. But it was not It's correct. Well, Yaya yeah, Jame told you to be burning people. He gave you a power which you never had. Was that not Yaya Jame involving himself in your work? This was an answer. For ya jamele kantel ya mar prunga sunkaro ni Saudi sunyola. Whether we would come to that. Ya jamele was the one who used to instruct us. Kuma kama nata wale jabola. But what you have here, member jam, is to say that former president ya jamele do involve in council work was not true. In fact, the truth is Yaya Jame was involving himself in your work. Oh, more, more. I was not aware of it except this. Say that uh, we should control the radios and the television to uh, control the preachers. This is it. And it was said to the hearing of the whole Gambia. Well, the Supreme Islamic Council, they dealt with the sighting of the moon, correct? And, and when we should pray. Supreme Islamic Council, the Karo Fanan Nakumo for the Kariju Bero, and in Fanan Bru Nyanta Sala, the Nyaming, Salikera Nyanta Kalalume. It also dealt with 
monitoring who is preaching and licensing of preachers. And we have to be able 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 to and to deal with the issue of uh, the differences between the religious scholars and imams. And the issue of fundraising for the majlis. Those are the four functions, correct? It could be others uh, are there which I was not aware of. But I was the one who said these ones. But you would agree that the two of those functions were not your traditional functions. It was Yaya Jame who gave them to you. But I was the one who said these ones. And these would be which ones? Praying on the same time with Mecca. Pro ne makabe ye salinyo la lunkili. No ne buka salinyo la lunkili. No, we never we never prayed with them at the same time. Yes, I, that's I, okay. what I mean. Are you referring to the, the Ramadan or the? Mm. That's uh, what the I mean. Tawaski. Yes, and the second one is monitoring who is preaching what and burning people. Alun flanja wale mnyenti. So it means 50% of your functions we are giving to you by Ayajam. Amunta wato ne la lo ta la tamandi kol mu kemeleti. Wato talu lo amunta ya jamale o diala. No no no. Well, you had four functions. Ah, amunta de lo dula na ne kuma balibulu. At least two were given to you by Yaya Jami. Ah, for the budget, we will get Yaya Jami to deal. That's fifty percent. Sungo ni salo Yaya Jami madi mola. The praying and the fasting, those were not given to us by Yaya Jami. Imam, don't try to confuse the issues. I'm not saying that Yaya Jami directed people must pray or people must not pray. That is not the issue, and you know it. What I am driving at is this issue of whether we should pray on the same day with Saudi or not. That is the question. Two issues were given to you by Yaya Jame to deal with. Yaya Jame kufla le di Allah. Wole mnyinti ko kuo ning makabe nyanta salla nyola lunkilinne. Kana kuo lu nyami jang. Ntebe menyini nkaka nrong. Wole mu wokangoti ni maka nyanta salla nyola lunkilinne. No, no, nyami tebule, but ntema nyami. So these things are mixed up with you, but I did not mix them up. Kasali ni maka, kasung ni maka, amabu ya jame buru. The same time with Mecca, or to fast the same time with Mecca, did not come from ya jame. Nganyine fo. This is what I said. What I am driving at is, that agenda of deciding when we fast and when we pray, that agenda was given to the Supreme Islamic Council by ya jame. You had accepted that. Wole mnyinti mbeda me mnyorika, mbeda mnyorika nda menka, wole mnyinti. Puru sumo la kewo, wala salo la kewo, anyanta kela nyaming wolo dula ya ya jamelo ya diyala. Mbe ole foka. Ayi njini nka nko hani. He asked me and I said no. So you were saying the only one he gave you was the issue of burning people. Woto mwasafo ko, ayi mendi yala wole mpurka mwulu tong. Wole muka kawando monito. That is to monito the preachers and... Television and radio. The television and radio stations. So, ning mu mu banu kas akalo wala ka. Amani kedo kas saun kamo ban. So the bans are based on that. You don't just jump on ban people. Principle olebiye. There are principles. Oni ko dro ka kamo lu ban kamo lu fengete. I accept. I accept that. Kasunda. I accept that the principle is good. Kasunda ko musar te kendoldi. Uh, there should be quality control. But it has to be based on law. There has to be authority given by law. In your case, the authority was given by man and it was not given by law. But it has to be authority given by law. And it was not given by law. That is, that is the issue. It was not an ordinary person. <laughs> yes, Except to you. He is the president. He was the president. Yes. But the president must operate uh, under the law. The president of okay. That question belongs to him. All right. In your statement, you said 
he referring to Yaya Jame never interfered on our job uh, we do make suggestion to him but he never dictate to us something that does not align with Islam was he in fact dictating to you? No, I'm not aware of that. Okay, we will come back to that. We will come back to that at some stage. So now, uh, Let's move away from the Supreme Islamic Council. Supreme Islamic Council. Just give me a minute. Minute killing dinner. Now let's go to the issue of the Ahmadis. Uh, we have received complaints from the Ahmadi community. Now, but perhaps before then, I should touch up on an important issue. Uh, there was this time when Pope Benedict took over as Pope. And he made a summons in which he said certain things about Islam. And uh, the world gathered about 138 uh, Islamic scholars. Uh, and uh, they wrote a letter to the Pope. And in this document, in their document, they said interesting things. And I want to check with you and uh, left whether you agree with some of the things those learned Islamic scholars have said. Uh, this was an open letter. Uh, that was addressed to the Pope. And uh, a number of the world leaders in the Christian faith. And the, the document was meant to bridge uh, Islam and Christianity. Uh, and this was written by those who were believed to be some of the leading scholars Prominent Muslim scholars. And the document was entitled, the letter was entitled, A Common Word Between Us and You. And letter on your two men fala wellem, Bella den kumo, memben tel ning ita tema. That is between Muslims and Christians. Uh, and uh, this was in response to what Pope Benedict said and the Muslims thought that they should respond to him. And the letter said a few things and I have to, I, I would quote them. It says the future of the world depends on peace between Muslims and Christians. And the 
This is one fundamental thing that the Islamic scholars said. Ni mukudo kuku ma baleti kukiling me yalongo Islam la ulona leafo. Do you accept that? Question da wala leba. Beka Cairo le nini? All of us seek peace. Uka Cairo le preach. We also preach peace. Yes. Thank you very much. Ilumbara. In page 29 of the document. Wa Cairo la lerat muang anin kolonto njango nyinto. Uh, the letter also talks about certain fundamental principles. And one of those is as follows. Love of the one God and love of the neighbor. As a Muslim cleric, do you accept that? Ako fwa iri temu misili me lonalti fwa isonda wala. Antoni Christiano ulte ma problem tije. I believe ta fena lanti lo fana believe ta fena. So there is no problem between us and the Christians. Nini siri inke futu no problem. Do ni tell te ma. They believe one thing and we also believe another thing. If we are living together, we could marry them and we have no problem. Na believe manke no manke kilinti. Baru wanya wanya mbe balurin. Our belief systems are not the same, but despite all of that. We are still living together. Good. In fact, uh, uh, it is it is stated that this historic letter is intended by the 138 signatories as an open invitation to Christians to unite with Muslims over the most essential aspects of their respective faiths, the um, principles of love of one God and love of the neighbor. Amunta ni lona keme lona tansa bani sayo ila ni jero muni neti ko ni kanunte ya anyanta tarla lari nyami ngulem na ala kilingo kanu nyami aning insi nyolo fana lu nyanta o kanu kilingo le soto no le ye nyanta o kanu kilingo le soto le ye o ngulem sarto ti ni lona lu yamenza feka banke. So it is also hoped that the recognition of the common ground. Goto njiko bala ko mbela korosiro belori ndame nkulu meni alonko imulunta ndamangulu tema will provide the followers of both faiths welebe nyi ndina fulolu bela mulu mako ila ka nyi ita ndila with a shared understanding adu isi fahamuro soto ibebe dena fahamuro mena that will serve to diffuse tensions around the world. You accept those principles, correct? So don't This is what I'm telling you. These are two faiths that are not the same. Special Gambia. But that difference does not uh, do us any harm, especially here in the Gambia. So family killing can be faithful at the very problem to you. In one family, you could have members of the two faiths there, but yet there is no problem. Uh, uh, thank you very much, ya Imam. Inum barabaka ya Imam. And in fact, some the foremost fundamental principles in this letter is the issue of one God and love your neighbor. Amunda between the letter of Fongo, Sarto Lukono Menkuma Yata Ye, Memu Nyonta Moti Ye, Walemu, Ka Ala Kilimo Kanu, and Inke Isinio Kanu. You accept that? Nin Kirisano Sondo, I will make a missile molati. All the Christians accept that they will all become Muslims. So, so let us accept that there are differences. But, uh, you, you see, but that does not cause any problems between us. You would accept that this demarche by the Islamic world, or this rapprochement, if I would call it like that, to, to the Pope, was Islam extending peace to people of other faiths. Amunda Mosafoko, ni lona lola nying dadaro yanyin kaito men dadateng puruka ki popie. Amunda kuwa memba kono wole mnyintiko ye dale yele puru ka wateria ni wabadi ya julo futandi si mokota ngulu mameni alonko ibe dina dole kan? Ibe dina dole kan no problem. They are in another religion, no problem. But they cannot do Islam over. But let them not come into Islam until they become Muslims. Uh, what is the difference 
uh, sorry, before I go to that, you know Islam, you have how many sects do you have? Ako Islam kono. Sapan sapan jamal le bije yalo ne jelle mu sapolu jelle be Islam kono. Islam di na kile na de. Islam is one religion. Ara batu nyalu. Uh, the ways of praying to God, how we perform ablution and the manner in which we pray, the scholars took that from the Al Quran and also through the ways of the Prophet. So sometimes their manifestations differ. For example, Malik, Malik, Imam Malik, Imam Malik, Rahimahullah. When you perform in ablution, you take from the forehead and uh, rub your hands backwards. Imam Shafi, for Imam Shafi, it is enough for you just to strike uh, the top of your head. Just touch your, uh, 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 the, the, the top of your forehead. So, lona lo si ata bari minna ata kambi ona ata wala mo inti ko ni madhab na nolo. Imam Abu Hanifa, rahimahullah. Imam Malik, rahimahullah. Imam Shafi, rahimahullah. Imam Hanbali, Ahmad bin Hanbali, rahimahullah. Ika vanyin ne ko school of thought. Nila mo madhab na nolo. There are there are many um, uh, schools of thought, but the four main schools of thought are the Hanafi, the uh, Maliki, the Safi, and the Hambali. So, Kila Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam, the Holy Prophet said, "Yahudul Talata Group Tang Tang Warawula Ninkiling." The Jews are divided into seventy-one groupings. Nasara Talata. The European race is divided into not European. Christian, is it? Because Nasaran, is that Christian? Nasaran. Would you Nasaran. say that's yeah. Christian? The, 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 the just okay. white man. Yeah. yeah. The, okay. The, so, the Nasaran, white Talata The white man is divided into seventy-two tribes. Not white man. Arabs are white man as well. So we can base it we on can say they are and say that they are Christians. Uh, there will be 73 sects in uh, Islam. They will all go to hellfire for killing. Just only one. They are asking who are those? He, the answer was that the route I am following with my followers, those who follow me are, the, are those who are going to survive from getting into the fire. Uh, is, is that Al Quran or is that Hadith? Hadith, Hadith. That is Hadith. Is it authentic Hadith? Or questionable hadith. According to hadith, dealing with all information, you need to know how to call it. No, hadith is not reliable. This is a secret. This is a true hadith, without fault. Secret. Is it strong or weak? Among the hadith, bamban di ko long for hadith long men sembodo ya. No, among the ko yeh hadith long odo karan na bar hadith bamban di ko. I know you must have learned a little bit about hadith, but this is a strong hadith. Falcunda, uh, maybe a member of the Falcunda. But uh, I am asking these questions uh -huh. just to show that there are lots of differences in Islam. Benyim benyim inka kang kaitan diko fatam fancy jamal le fanambe Islam o kono. But you have brought out an interesting hadith to show that of the 73 sects of Islam, all 72 believers would go to hell. But Fire, except one. How many Islamic sects believe in that hadith? Islam Oh. Most of the young, I can't deny the claim. I knew hadith so far, but I love and do not know what to do. Someone sat here and quoted this hadith, but uh, in the end, but can you answer my question instead of answering your own question? No, saying in any income in a Munjabiola, in a man, if I'm soon in Karo Jabi. My question is, 
which Islamic sects believe in that hadith? Islam la sapa jumanyo le sonta wa hadith wala. Momo kamu mislimut. Anyone that claims to be a Muslim. Fanama nyi hadith oji. Except the person does not see this hadith. Ya imam, please help us answer that question. Ya imam de mayo to jabi. Which Muslim sects believe in that hadith? Islam la sapa jumanyo le sonta wa hadith wala. This is what I'm telling you. Because uh, I would Im I would imagine that members of the 72 sects would not believe in that hadith. What on ning ayat la sapat tauro la ning saboko no tauro la ning fulo baby taja na bako no. What on lam yindu walu imanso ning hadith wala. Ning ayat la ye fam bula wako no. If I told they immerse themselves in that. But how many Muslims are there? Muslim wallet. Even hypocrites claim to be Muslims. So uh, <laughs> I, I think uh, you 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 are just trying to muddy the waters. Uh, you answering your own questions. I'm wondering how many left a potole mamandila jioko. Tell us whether those seventy-two sects whether they believe in that hadith or not. Come and follow them. Where is Tauro la ni saba? Tauro la ni mfulo baby ta jahana ba? For ulu fanalu Tauro la ni mfulo imala ni hadith wala ba? Your question is uh, shrouded a mystery. And I think I have answered that question earlier on. Anyone that claims to be a Muslim. Then that person is a member of that single group that will be saved. That is where the person has put him or herself in. No one has taken him or herself outside. So in a sense, you're telling us that, that se those 72 other sects are just mentioned, but they do not exist because they don't have members. Amunda wato silang eka ni sapata wuro la ni mfulo menu foteng menu bitha jahana ba afuta le drum bari mantera caring. Nanda ma vete caring de. Sila ko salala salabe caring na dulata ko be caring. I did not say they were not. They are not existing. The prophet said they are existing, and I do believe that they exist. So tell us which Islamic sects believe. Amunda wado saying afonye Islam is sapa jumanyo le lata. This 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 hadith. Ning hadith wala. Itara group wo group to be niye ninga ning hadith wala pole entel bijele. If you go to any one particular group and ask them, they will tell you that this hadith we are there. So kafiro don't ne kafa fa ya dem kafiro le. So it is only an unbeliever who says of himself that he is an unbeliever. But a Muslim munafiko ne ne ma fo ekonde munafiko le tan ne ma fo ekonde ma ke Muslim mod. But a Muslim hypocrite never will admit that they are hypocrites or they are hip Muslim hypocrites. Okay. Uh, in essence, you are telling us that there are seventy-three sects. And all Muslims would be classified within these 73 sects. Correct? It's the Muslims who are going to be divided into 73 sects. Okay. You agree? Not that way. The, the Prophet said, The Prophet said that those behind me will be divided into 73 sects. Yes, 73 My sects will divide to 73 sects. Yes, yes. correct. So means the sum total of Muslims they'll be divided into 73 sects. Okay. No. Yes. The members of all 72 will go to hell. That is what the Holy Prophet said. Only adherents of one sect would go to heaven. Amunta was sapa killing you. Wolu menu sonda menu be okono wolu na bita arjana. But all Muslims claim to be in that one set. But bitu misilu mo lu menu be be was sapa killing you nyingkono. They all claim to be in that one set. Amunda misilu mo lu be kanya na fokoi be was sapa le kono. No. Yes. Therefore, it means nobody claims to be part of the seventy-two. 
no to mota je men ka foko atebe wo tawro lani fula dole kono and our beliefs are also different adun na lanno lu fana lu fatam fatam tawo nyale so who in those beliefs should definitely be classified in the 72 say men yo lanna fason lu soto juma nyol le multi mosa fono men better law sapatan ro lani fulo kono I had this sort of community being can be. It is in the hadith which says that what? those that are in what I am doing today, what? which is the Al Quran and the ways of the Prophet, can be and in the cyborg. What I am doing today and my followers. So, so all Muslim uh, sects see themselves to be in that same yeah, uh, group. But, but you have difficulty telling us who is in the 72. Bare in saying you will call a Daltica for you, Jumano Lebe or Taurola in Flogon. It seems to us, therefore, that the seventy two has no known members. A Katam Feloco or Taurola in Fulo, Moto Lucono. Molbi Yere, there are members who Kila Kila for the Salas or Cabe Sotola, Abisotola. The Prophet said that there will be members, and they are members. Kila Fita Futala, the new Futa Jama. Where you are driving me to when we arrive, I shall tell you. So there would be members, and therefore there are members. That's the way you put it. What do you think about the people who are living in the world? What do you think about the people who are living in the world? And you know... Yadi. How? I think about the people who are living in the world. I think about the people who are living in the world. The people who are living in the world. The people who are living in the world. Which group? The 72. The people who are living in the world are living in the world. It will not fail to be. There are people. But are you members. cannot tell us who are there. But it is for no line. Juma nyolu mo fason juma nyolu lebiji. Fano for that time. Until we get there. Uh, let me ask you. But ngai nyenga. The adherents of the Hanafi. Wo mumunda Hanafi silo dung menu be silo kang. Um, Abu Hanifa rahimahullah. No, answer the question yes or no. We don't want to go into a history of uh, Hanafi when he came into being and his teachings. And answer yes or no. The Hanafis, do they qualify or they do not qualify? Ako Hanafi olo. Aka menyi ninka wole mu. Ibe, debo silatili ndungu leka mfudu imantara silo nyinka. Lafto drone nyi ninka la. Bari niko ebe duna ila tariko okono janga siku ulu mendi. Manda duna tariko okono. Bara ala fita minna ni maybe one hour mbemba ndila le. So, jinyata purunga kuhose na yandi. Yes, but all we want to know is, all we want to know is who is in which box. Lafta melona, jumale be kune jumakono. The Hanafi. Are they in the correct box or they are in the 72? Wo Hanafi olu. Ibe kune tonya njine kono bang folu be utauro ula nifulo le kono. Alo ngafo yinu kwa misili mwole ya mera kwa kona is. Nyin madahibu olu kono. Wole mu Hanafiya, Malikiya, Shafiiya, Hambaliya. Ngamira ngwa ufale. I told you that amongst the scholars that the Muslims recognized were Hanafi, Maliki, Safi and Hambali. So these are... All the ways of the prophet. prophet yeah. uh, okay, uh, this is also for my own education. You have Hanafi in Iraq, in Syria, in Turkey, and Iraq, those countries. Syria, Turkey, and in Bangkok. Is that correct? Mm -hmm. yeah, yes. but, but in Iraq, you have more Shiite. Than Iraq, Sunni, isn't it? Shialu Shiata Iraq katambi Sunni wala fonde. Shialu be madhabu jumala ka. Mandar Hanafi, Mandar Maliki, Mandar Shafi, Mandar Hambali. The Shias are in which sect? They don't belong to the Hanafi. They don't belong to the Safi. They don't belong to the Maliki or the Hambali. So they tell me if I'm some group or So they are a separate individual group of their own. That's why I asked you before. Who are the groups that do not belong? But you have refused to say. 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 But you 
within themselves. So, but you would accept that in modern Islam, what you have would be mainly Shiite and Sunni as two groups. Abari ibe sulna ko Islam kono kafufula lebije Shialu and in Sunni ulu. No, na na Islam our Islam. Kila imin tu jan sallallahu alaihi wasallam. The one that was left here by the Holy Prophet. Shia man soto kila la time of sallallahu alaihi wasallam. There were no Shias during the time of the Prophet. Do do you accept that there is a Muslim sect called Shiite Muslim? Akobari foi beson na njena lako. Muslim mo lu kono mo lu bije meni alonko ekoite lu Shia leti. Ah, iko mo Muslim mo leti. Shia le mo iko mo Muslim mo leti. Well, they say that they are Muslims, but they are Shias. And according to you, the Supreme Islamic Council, they are not Muslims. But I tell the Carol, the Supreme Islamic Council, what do I call you? Man, can you see me? Well, I'm not going to call Shia group or let. Which is why I told you that the Shias are just a group. Uh, Mr. Chair, I think this is a convenient point to stop. Between Shia Council, we have a lot of people who are not Our second break. Thank you, Council, and thank you, Imam Fati. I think um, uh, we need a one-hour lunch break um, uh, to be free to a certain extent from the Fal Fati duel on who is going to go to hell. <laughs> and, uh, Say again, Mr. Chair. <laughs> you missed that. I said we are taking a break from the Fal Fati duel on who is going to go to hell. Uh, so <laughs> but, but he seems to have the prescription. That would calm down our, <laughs> the lunch would calm down our fears a little bit. Okay. So we will take um, a, a one hour break, come back at um, half past two. Thank you very much. The meeting much. is adjourned. Thank you all. Thank you. <laughs>